to another video. I'm so glad you stopped in today. I have a good one for you. It is my Christmas decor haul, part one. Um, so I wanted to hurry up and get this video out because y'all, this year is, it's, it's, it's kind of weird. So a lot of the retailers are putting their stuff out really early, but it's also selling out really early. I know some of this stuff I bought probably a month ago. And a lot of it is a lot of it is no longer in stock. So I wanted to hurry up and get this video out. Like I said, this is just part one. Um, I went to a bunch of different stores and I will name the stores because I, I, I separated it by store. Normally I don't do that, but I did separate it by store um, just to make it easier and more organized. Um, before I get into the video, let me just stop and say hello. My name is Tangi, if you are new here, and this is Lifestyle of a Decor Natural. I'm known as a Decor Natural here on YouTube as well as on Instagram, so please follow me there if you are not. And I love to make uh, YouTube content, Instagram content regarding my home. We just moved into a new house that we built recently. Um, I think we closed in mid-May and we moved in in June. So we've been here a little over four and a half months, almost five months. I am in the process of still decorating the home. So um, all of the rooms are not finished. Yeah, as you guys know, it is a process. When you are pretty much starting from scratch, I mean, we had a house that we were um, renting before, but a lot of that stuff I got rid of and I started just from scratch. So anyway, not too much talking let's get on to the haul so i'm going to start with target since i think that's where most of the stuff came from and that's where a lot of you guys like to shop um so like i said some of this stuff i bought probably like a month ago so it may not be in stock anymore but check your local target you never know they may be restocking since they put stuff out so early they may be bringing stuff back in the next you know coming weeks because we are still a long way off from christmas Anyway, let's move on. So, starting with Target, I bought this pillow. So, oh, let me say this. So, <clears throat> you may see two different themes going on here. That's because I do have two different themes. <laughs> um, so, for my downstairs area, I am really wanting to go more towards the natural, um, earthy, um, almost rustic vibe. Um, a lot of wood, a lot of um, metals, a lot of furs, just really, really natural, natural pieces. My kids don't care nothing about that. So I wanted to make a space for them um, that was more traditional that they could actually enjoy. So upstairs in the game room, we're going to do more traditional reds and whites and greens and colors and things like that, just so they can still feel like Christmas. You know what I mean? So anyway. I just want to throw that out there. So anyway, starting with Target, I got this pillow. And as you can see, it has Mr. and Mrs. Claus on there. And they are looking super cute together. They are mocha. And I love that. Of course, they had, you know, they did have um, like a Caucasian one. I guess it would be Caucasian. But they had the brown skin one. And I thought that was cute. So this is going to go upstairs um, in the game room for the girls. Then I got this pillow. This one is um, for my daughter, my youngest daughter's room. Um, we're going to do pink and red in her room. And I just thought it was really cute, especially with the little tassels. I think each of these pillows were $15. But I just love the little, um, I love the colors. And then I love this on the back with the little pom-poms. I thought that was so cute. And then the tassels. Yeah, so both of those were 15 now, this was something that I bought like a month ago. It may have been more than a month ago at this point. I don't even remember, but I got these um, glass ornaments from the Wonder Shop. It's only one, two, three, four, five. It's only eight, but it's like brown and white and black. And they're just eight small ornaments. I actually need probably like one or two more boxes, but I can't find them. So um, I just got this. I don't even know if I'm going to keep this. Um, I may just go looking for some more ornaments because this is just not enough. But this was $10 and they are glass. Then also from Target from their Bulldog Spot, I bought 
some gift bags um i have a thousand gift bags but i just i don't know i just couldn't maybe i have a problem but i couldn't pass them up but i bought these kind of big ones they're pink and they say no peeking oh what fun um then they have like the santa hat and the i guess that's hot cocoa the gloves the mistletoe the ornaments it's real cute and um whatever gifts that i buy for my youngest daughter i'll probably put in these bags because she loves pink and then i bought just these um just for gifts for anybody it says let it snow on there with the snowflake it has like kind of like some glitter on there if you can see that but i bought these just for just for whoever um a lot of times we just like family members and stuff like that we just need something to put their stuff in a bag so got that uh this is another thing that i bought a while ago and i don't i, I don't know if i'm gonna keep this either but i got this wreath from the wonder shop and it was twenty dollars really cute i'm loving the um I just, it's not really gold i guess it's more like a it's not copper either maybe like bronze maybe that's the color i'm looking for but i love the little uh the bronze balls on there or the berries um and then of course the um grapevine wreath but that was twenty dollars and then um i just bought these little um what do you call these nutcrackers these look this little three piece and it's in all of like the metallics it's like a champagne color a gold and then like a bronze color there i got these three this set was ten dollars i thought they were really cute um i think i'm gonna keep these but this this was another thing i bought so long ago the stuff that i bought like a month ago i ordered online by the way that it was not in store um also from Target. Now, this stuff I got more recently. I got just these two bottle brush trees in like this cream color. And this one actually lights up. So, I thought that was really cute. This one was $5. And then this one, it doesn't light up, but it's like the, the smaller version. Um, and it was $3. And then I got this little gold little tree just to, just to put just anywhere. But... I just noticed this chip on the back and I don't know if that happened after I bought it and I or if, I don't know if I did that or if it was like that and I just didn't notice it really cute it was only a dollar so I don't know I may still keep it it's just a just some just a filler just to put just anywhere where I need some decor so and it was a dollar um and then I bought just this little this one little um brown like I guess she's a ballerina Look at her little earrings. So cute. I bought this for my daughter's tree that she'll have in her room. She has other, she has so many other um, ornaments, but this was just one I just wanted to add to her collection because I thought it was super cute. And of course she's a little brown girl. Love it. Um, I think that's all from Target. Let's move on to Home Goods. I did not get that much stuff from Home Goods, y'all. But like I said, this is just part one. So I'm sure I'll be going back. Um, and then um, I'll show y'all, you know, whenever I whenever I go back, if I go back and get some more stuff. But uh, for now, this is all I have. I got this tree, which I think is so pretty. Like, I don't even know if this video is like doing it any justice, y'all. It is so pretty. Um, it is, it was $9.99 and I guess it's ceramic. I'm not really sure. It may, it may be, it's not wood. It looks like wood, but it's not. So I think it may be ceramic, but it has like the little gold tips. It's so pretty. I love this thing. It was $9.99. Then y'all, I am so upset. I bought this beautiful, beautiful mercury glass candle and the scent is... Holiday Citrus. So, bought the candle. The person that checked me out did not wrap the candle. I thought to myself, maybe I should tell them to wrap this candle because I don't want it to break. But then again, I was like, oh, I'll be okay. I'm, I'm going right home. I'll just be really careful. 
So today when I was gathering all my stuff, I picked the bag up and I heard like a clink. And I was like, oh, I know, I know that was not my candle. And sure it was, it was my candle and it broke. And I'm so sad, it's broken. So what I'm trying to figure out is if I'm gonna take it back because it, it's partial. The person did not wrap it properly. They didn't wrap it at all. It was like a teenager. He was checking me out and he, he really looked like he did not want to be there. Um, so um, he didn't wrap it. He just kind of put it in the bag. He, he carefully put it in the bag, but he just kind of put it in the bag and was like, here you go. But um, I should have told him to wrap it. I should have. So it's partially my fault. So I don't know. I may try to take it back and see what they say, but it's so pretty. Oh, I love it. It is so pretty. It's like a brownish, I don't know, amberish. I don't even know what the color is, but it's so pretty. Anyway, got that. And then, last thing from Home Goods, like I said, I didn't get that much stuff. I just got some soaps. This one is by Castle Bell. It's Peace and Joy Winterberry. Got this one. Smells amazing. I think this is probably going to go in the girls' bathroom. And then I got this one, Sand and Fog Holiday Berry. This will probably go in the downstairs bathroom. It smells amazing as well. Y'all can see that. Somebody keeps texting me, y'all. I'm sorry. Um, and it's very distracting. Oh, yeah, it smells so good. I got to get a couple of more soaps because I just need them. All right, so that's going to be all for, what was that? Home goods. Moving on to Hobby Lobby. And I said that I, that most of my stuff came from Target. I may have gotten more stuff from Hobby Lobby, actually. But anyway, so I got these small wreaths. Well, they're not that small. They are how many inches? Um, 10 by 10 by 2.5, whatever that means. I guess 10 inches. Um. But I got these, um, what do you call these? Cedar wreaths. I got two. Um, and they were 50% off when I bought them. And they were $11.99 with 50% off. So what is that? $6. Um, so I got two of those. I may need to get a couple of more. I don't really know. Um, I have a thousand of these little small wreaths from years past. So I... But there, some of them are flogged, some of them are like glittery, some of them have. So I don't know. I, I really like just the simplistic look of these. What I plan to do is just tie like a velvet ribbon um, on them and then just um, hang them on the back of my chairs. I may do a couple of, a couple on my cabinets in the kitchen, but I like the simplicity of these. So that's why I'm like, mm, I may go back and get a couple more. Um, And then... Also from Home Goods, I got these stems. I think they were also 50% off at the time. Yeah, these were $5.99. I got three. And then they have like these little berries on the end. I don't know what kind of berries are supposed to be, but I got these three stems. Um, and I guess they're like cedar as well. Really pretty, really um, pretty realistic looking. Got those. And then, I know y'all heard it, I got this string of bells because bells are everything. Y'all, I'm so upset. I bought some bells last year and I cannot find them. Like the big ones, um, that you, I had them hanging on my mantle last year. Um, I don't know where they are. I lost a lot of stuff in the move. I had, um, like a matte black, I had a couple of matte black nutcrackers. Um, and then I had some other stuff. I cannot find it. I used to always wonder how people lost stuff when they moved. Like, why don't, how, how, how come you can't keep up with your stuff? But I guess I see now, cause I cannot find it. I don't know if I made a mistake and threw it away or gave it away. Cause we did give a lot of stuff. We did donate a lot of stuff and we threw away a lot of stuff. So I don't know if that's what happened to it, but I cannot find it. So I'm a little bit upset. But I did buy these, this bell garland, and I'm not sure what I'm going to do with it yet. More than likely, it's going to go 
on my mantle when I get a mantle because I don't have one yet. Or it's going to go on the stair, uh, like the stair banister, whatever, with some um, garland, some greenery. Got those. And then I got, um, so all of that stuff was, when I bought it, it was 50% off. Well, I went back and now Christmas is 60% off. So I bought four of these stockings with the fur at the top. They had some that were completely fur, like like that color, but all but fur all over. And I, at first I had those in my basket and then I was like, mm, that's too much fur. So I went back and got these and these were $17.99 each, but again, they were 66% off. So I picked up four. I think I ended up paying like $30 for all four. Got those. And then, um, so they also had, oh, wait, let me show you these. I got these two trees. They're ceramic. I got this kind of bigger one and then the smaller one. And these, the smaller one was $15.99. The bigger one was $25.99, but again, 66% off. Got these. And um, if you can see that, they kind of have like a gold, like on the edges, it's like gold. I thought they were really pretty. So I picked up those. And then, so they also have, um, am I saying six? I'm sorry, y'all. It's 60% off of Christmas now. I keep saying 66. The 66% off was fall stuff. So what I did was I picked a couple of things for fall, well, for Christmas that came from their fall collection. I felt like you could still make it work for Christmas. So I got these two little houses and they have like the um, copper tops and they light up. Y'all see that? How cute is that? So I got the big one. It was $9.99, 66% off, not 60. And then I got the small one and it was $8.99 with 66% off. Tell me that can't still work for Christmas. Like, yeah. So yeah, got those. And then I bought these LED candles. I got the small one, the medium, and the large one. They're in, in glass and um, they're LED uh, faux candles. They take batteries, so I can't really show you how they look because um, I don't have any batteries in there. But these were a part of the fall, like the fall stuff. And so they were 66% off. The big one was $18.99, take 66% off of that. The medium was $14.99. And then the small one was $11.99. So got that. And then I think that is all for home goods. And then moving on, I just stopped by, I think TJ Maxx. I think I got this from TJ Maxx. Yep. Stopped by TJ Maxx one day just browsing around. They didn't have a whole lot because it was it was a while ago. It was probably like two or three weeks ago and they didn't have a whole lot yet. I'm pretty sure that they are pretty well stocked now. Um, and I got this mug and it's a brown Mrs. Claus. I already have one with just Santa Claus, a brown Santa Claus. So when I found this one, I was like, oh, I gotta have her. She was $5.99, which is, I don't know, most, most mugs are like $4.99, but she was $5.99. I felt like that wasn't too, too much. But it is hand wash only or hand wash recommended. And you probably cannot put it in the um, microwave because the other one that I had like this, you can't microwave it. And it's and, and they suggest you only hand wash it. But I thought she was super cute. Got her. And then, um, I, you know what? I thought I had gotten more, uh, more stuff from Kirkland's, but I guess I didn't. Um, but I only got this mohair um throw in the red black and white plaid it was $34.99 but I think at the time when I got this I think their throws were 40% off so I got 
this it's super cute again this is one of the things that's gonna go upstairs with the girls because they're doing red up there or i'm doing red up there for them and then i stopped into michael's last night um just looking around i was really looking for some more ornaments but i didn't find any but i did run up on this wreath which i thought was like right up my alley like this is exactly the look i'm going for as far as my downstairs um it was 24.99 but it was i think 40 percent off so i think i paid like 15 or 16 dollars for this i saw this same wreath similar wreath not same but similar wreath in target and i think it was hearth and hand it was it was a little bit bigger but it was pretty much the exact same. I think the only difference was it had like a, a pine cone or a couple of pine cones. And I think it had like a bell and a ribbon. I can add a bell and a ribbon. And that thing was, I think $40, I think. I think it was $40. I can add a bell and a ribbon. I got that. So I'm just going to do that. I'm just going to add the bell and the ribbon. And I, y'all, it looks almost identical to this. Except, like I said, it was a little bit bigger. So yeah, I got that for $16. And then lastly, um, I think the last thing is Amazon. So told y'all I lost my bells and I was upset. Um, <laughs> so I, I can't remember who I saw. I don't know if it was somebody on YouTube, if it was on Instagram, I don't know. But I saw somebody with these bells from... Um, from Amazon and y'all I bought these bells it's a set of three and when I saw them I was like oh dang they probably expensive let me go let me go see just see how much they charge me for them and if they too much I'm not gonna get them they're still in the plastic because they are some for real rustic like for real rusted bells like they got like dirt in them. <laughs> I don't know. They're like for real rusty. Like you can hear the dirt inside. I'm kind of scared to turn them all the way over. But anyway, I kept the plastic on them. But I got this one. Look how big that is. This one. And let me see if I can get the third one. And the little small one. This whole set was $28. Look how big and pretty and rustic. And I love these, love them. Um, I don't care for the rope. I'm taking that off and I'm gonna put like some velvet ribbon or something on them, but $28, I couldn't believe it. I couldn't believe it. I snatched it up so quick. But y'all, that's it. That's it for this Christmas decor haul. Like I said, this is just part one because I do have some more things that I need to get. All that dust. I do have some more things that I need to get. So hopefully I'll be coming at you with another haul here soon. But now, as always, thank you guys so much for watching. If you have not already, please subscribe to the channel. Hit that like button and also hit the notification bell so you can know the next time I upload a video. And I will talk to you guys in the next one. Bye.